Got clouds rolling on in, but it is going to be a very nice evening for many locations. The only problem is the wind out there, but temperatures are comfortable. We're presently still in the mid 60s. Look at how dry the atmosphere is. Relative humidity just 26%, but south to southeast winds of 23 gusting into the 30s. So here's your hourly forecast. 7 p.m. still hanging on to 60 degrees. Then we drop into the 50s with the cloud cover kind of uniform temperatures in the low 50s right through the early morning hour. Check it out radar right now. There's a little bit of activity off to the northwest and a few light showers out in west central Iowa. Not expecting this tonight to get too vigorous, although can't rule out a thunderstorm to the north as the night goes along. The problem tomorrow is the threat for severe weather and there is a severe risk all the way from just north of Highway 20 down and through northern Missouri. Have to keep an eye out for potentially some strong and severe thunderstorms, especially during the late afternoon. Traveling tomorrow, those thunderstorms all the way down to Kansas City and St. Louis. Dry weather, Green Bay, Chicago, and some colder air out to the west in Rapid City. They're high 44 degrees. So here's Futurecast. Again, a few showers and thunder showers west and northwest tonight. Here's a little more activity that fires in during the early morning hour. Then as we slide through Wednesday morning, I think generally dry, some storms up in Minnesota. Here comes our line of storms, 6, 7 o'clock here in the metro. This would be the potential for the strongest severe storms. They move on through, hanging around midnight up to the north. And then another little piece of energy rides through Thursday morning with some showers. And then we could get another round of showers, especially north of Highway 20 Thursday night with some colder air, maybe mixing in a little bit of snow up towards the Minnesota border. But here's rain tracker with the first about a rain out there. You see some heavier amounts to the north. Mason City near an inch around 3500s here in the metro. If you get underneath one of those thunderstorms, you would see more six tenths of an inch in Atoma. So the forecast across the state tomorrow, generally mid 60s thunderstorms and winds out there. Southwestern Isle arriving mid to late afternoon, 67 Guthrie Center, Creston 67 degrees. A chance for some showers and thunder showers tonight, then some thunderstorms tomorrow. Carroll near 70, Esterville 59 degrees. Northeastern Iowa wait until a little later in the day for these thunderstorms. Marshalltown near high 63 and then thunderstorms in southeastern Iowa during the evening hour and the threat for some stronger storms. Newton 64, Centerville 66 degrees. So the forecast tonight 50 degrees for low in the metro. Mostly cloudy again some showers and thunder showers to the northwest. South winds stay breezy. Tomorrow the best chance for the stronger storms late in the day towards the evening hour 67 degrees with south winds at 10 to 20. Again, showers mixing in with some wet snow in northern Iowa on Thursday. Look at how the temperatures drop 54. This would be morning showers Friday 51. Good timing for the weekend, especially on Sunday. High around 62 with nice sunshine and then 50s and 60s as we head the next week.